Are you looking for the best gaming headsets under $100? In this video, we will break down the top gaming headsets under $100 on the market. Before we get started with our video detailing the best gaming headsets under $100 on the market, we have included links in the description for each product mentioned, so make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting off at number 1, we have the SteelSeries Arctis 5. The SteelSeries Arctis 5 gaming headset offers a brilliant sound that can be further tuned for personal preference, exceptional comfort, and one of the best microphones in the under $100 category. It's good to see SteelSeries hasn't overdone it in terms of design, and while keeping things simple, they have managed to create some very sleek looking headphones. The simplistic color and look are matched by relatively unoffensive shapes and some very nice ear cups with just the right amount of RGB lighting. This gaming headset is relatively lightweight at just 0.3 kilograms, and they don't look or feel too bulky like some other gaming headsets. The suspended strap cushions your head nicely, while the soft padding on the ear cups never seems to irritate or crush your ears too much. Overall, the Arctis 5s are supremely comfy and the construction feels solid, leaving you with a great, long-lasting pair of headphones. This set has award-winning sound quality that you will see in gaming, however I wouldn't expect to replace a good pair of audio headphones for music anytime soon. To accompany the sound quality, we see a studio quality microphone, giving you some clarity with those in-game calls. The SteelSeries Arctic 5s are an excellent set of gaming headphones, with a comfortable design and intuitive software to boot. This headset offers refined sound and will serve you well for gaming, however the cable is rather too long, so a bit of cable management may be required. At number 2, we have the HyperX CloudFlight Wireless. HyperX feature in many headset breakdowns thanks to their diverse range and affordable prices. The HyperX Cloud Flights are considered one of the best wireless gaming headsets around the $100 category. The design to these is quite plain, but represents the HyperX brand, with the classic black and red accented color scheme. The design may be simplistic, but the comfort is quite impressive, with memory foam featuring in the ear cups. This gaming headset feels very robust, with just enough adjustment to keep them comfy for even the biggest of heads. The sound quality from the Cloud Flights is of good quality, and the headset performed well in games, making it easy to hear subtle enemy noise. This headset did seem a little too bassy for me, but it could be sorted with some tweaking, and the mic was of okay quality, although I would have preferred to see a retractable microphone featured. This headset may just creep out of budget, but they needed to feature on the $100 category. The HyperX Cloud Flight Gaming headset has an excellent wireless range, with minimal to no latency issues, and as far as headsets at this price go, you will struggle to beat the value of these. At number 3, we have the Corsair Void Pro. The Corsair Void Pro RGB headset is the sequel to the plain old Corsair Voids. This updated pair of headphones gets an increase in audio quality and features 7.1 surround sound. The first thing to note with the Void Pros is that they look 100% like a gaming headset, and they would be ideal for day-to-day -day music around the office. With sharp angles and squared off ear cups, they appear very eSport, and its design has grown on me. The ear cups also feature RGB, and despite looking quite nice, it is just the Corsair logo that lights up. They are mostly of plastic construction and feel a little flimsy. You would think if they feel like flimsy plastic, they would be light, but they are actually a little heavier than most in this category, at 0.4 kilograms. This is the wired version we are recommending, but this gaming headset is also available in wireless for the cable haters out there. The sound quality wasn't all that bad on these, especially when you factor in the price. You can, of course, tweak the audio in the Corsair software, but you will find all the EQ settings tailored towards gaming, and they do a good job. The audio seemed to be vivid, with the surround sound assisting in the games, and adding a sense of immersion. Overall, the Void Pros impressed me, and with a little tweaking, they weren't too bad for music either. The mic was a bit average for recording or streaming, but for gaming, there were no complaints. If you're a hardcore gamer, you won't be disappointed at the value of the Corsair Void Pro RGB gaming headset. At number 4, we have the Razer Kraken TE. Razer headsets as a whole are generally good, with build quality often being superb. Unfortunately, with some Razer headsets after a while, they can begin to leak sound, and this is where the Kraken TE seems to have been improved over plain Krakens. This headset is currently at the lowest price it has ever been, and it offers seriously good value for what you are getting. The design isn't all that new for Razer, and the Kraken TEs don't have any noticeable design changes. It's a very visual pleasing design, as you would expect from Razer, and the headphones really do look and feel premium. The ear cups are larger than the non-tournament edition, but not so big you couldn't wear these as your everyday music headphones. This gaming headset features a retractable noise-canceling microphone, which is decent and probably my favorite feature, as the mic can be kept safe while traveling or just plain hidden. The volume controls actually feel responsive for once, and I quite like the bulky nature of the controls too. The headset can be connected by USB or 3.5mm audio, but the USB connects the amp to your PC, 
and then you plug in the 3.5mm jack into the amp controls. This is a surprisingly comfy headset, and much more so than the older Krakens thanks to the oversized ear cuffs. The headband is soft and rests nicely on your head, while there is still a nice amount of adjustment coming from the cups to make them surprisingly comfy for extended sessions. For a low price, you were getting great sound quality, a well thought out design, and high levels of comfort. At number 5, we have the Logitech G433. The Logitech G433 gaming headset offers 7.1 surround sound, an interesting fabric design. With this pair of headphones, we see a detachable microphone and plenty of connectivity options. The fabric design is quite nice aesthetically, and I suppose a better alternative for those that live in hotter climates, as faux leather can be a pain. Despite the material being different from the rest in this category, this headset is quite plain, but Logitech always goes for functionality over style. Despite the fabric material feeling rather nice, the overall headset didn't seem quite as comfy as gaming headsets with a suspended strap. These didn't stack up too bad though, and the adjustable ear cups moved enough to get them in a comfortable position. This headset is well balanced, with a tonal range that doesn't seem to be too bassy. Gaming in general was pleasant across a wide selection of games. Thanks to the simplistic style of the G433s, you could use them for everyday music, but they aren't exactly impressive in the music department, so don't go replacing your decent everyday headphones with these. This headset is of solid construction, and while being simplistic, it's a very attractive headset. The sound quality may not be as good as the others on this list, but it's good enough for gaming. Overall, we have something of high build quality that looks the part too. So that sums up our top gaming headsets under $100 of 2020. We hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on the video. And if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have a great day.